The communications director for Representative Bonamici said all this happened as the congresswoman and her husband were leaving an event around 845 on Friday. Around Northwest 19th and Everett, police say a driver turned into the couple, knocking them down. Following an event hosted by Congregation Beth Israel in Northwest Portland, a driver struck Representative Suzanne Bonamici and her husband, U.S. District Judge Michael Simon, as the couple crossed Everett Street Friday night. Although police say she was driving at a low speed, the impact sent the congresswoman to the hospital. John Cushing was on his way to the bus stop when he came across the scene. I heard some sort of a disturbance on the other side of 19th. And then I saw a woman lying in the street and a bunch of people clustered around her. And then somebody shouted, call 911. While he was connecting with dispatchers, Cushing said the group diverted traffic away from the crash site. They kind of knelt around her and they were waving off the cars. And then they waved all the cars forward so that the fire engine could get to where she was lying in the street. Cushing said first responders got to the intersection within minutes. The congresswoman's team confirmed she was treated for a concussion and laceration on her head and her husband for minor injuries. Now out of the hospital, Representative Bonamici is expected to make a full recovery. Well wishes continue to pour in. We just want her to have a very speedy recovery, her husband as well. Congresswoman Bonamici is a fighter and we just uh, know that like everything else in her life, she's up to the challenge and we just want her to get better real quick. Last month, Portland police reported a 70 year high in pedestrian deaths at more than 30 people killed in these crashes. Peabot keeps track of the traffic deaths and injuries within the city, but does not have injury data available for the past two years. Alma McCarty, KGW News.